he is all confidence this past December. Sure, that was he's in that start. five caps to his name. The time a spot and a half. This sets of players. It is such a fantastic occasion. Dream of a nation, strikers, and that's the coach of Nico Donia. We heard from him earlier. Felipe. So opening group stage match here of the FIFA World Cup 2026 OFC qualifier. They lose it, they come back, and they win position once again. It's Nathaniel Eddy. Tommy Sammy is arriving. Sammy digs it away from the goalkeeper. Win and achieve the highest of success at the international level this could be the tournament that he puts in uh, and uh, gets things going Shane Sakayal will calm the nerves and the ball over the top out comes Ronald Warrison had it covered experience through ball Apologies, that is Joris Keno this time on the right side of defence. The stadium in Port Villa will have New Zealand play Tahiti. And the day after, we will have Vanuatu taking on Samoa. Well, the referee's gone down. Ziola is, is a fine, fine specimen of character that he is as they take it. So, Ramarissan takes it. He's looking down well, Fenerbahce. Caledonia take a short free kick the training ground move didn't work for them but they pick up that ball Shane Wallapan Wallapan trying to get away couldn't do it either way but Papua New Guinea not too far out a drive coming from distance Warrison not happy at all with his defense and that motions Oh, brilliantly played by Keno. He finds space. Matello coming through. Just needed to keep it down. Morrison again, not happy at all. Guinea. This move was brilliantly orchestrated. Good ball played by Keno. And then the Morgan Matello into the area earlier on. Again, they give away possession. And this time it's the captain who's the guilty party. New Caledonia. Shot coming through. Well saved by Warrison. Second time I'm asking Warrison once again. And that is why he is the custodian of the Papua New Guinea national team for he, for Papua New Guinea. He couldn't take it away from the opposing captain Ziola. And then Ziola just laid it back. The shot by Wari saved by Warrison following through a four pop. And a patch with a switch into the area. Penalty. The skipper goes down. Artie Keppel was back trying to defend. Down went the skipper Ziola. And no, this was it. He was closer to the action. He made the call. And this was the ball played through by Fenepage over the top. Every says there was contact. Probably the first a choice a spot kick taken. Joseph Atale can run or Warrison pull off. I see. Atale. Up he comes. Places. Easily done by Joseph Atale. Nicaldonia go up by a goal to nail in the 20th minute. Yeah. 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 Well, welcome back. To the international stage, Joseph Atale and Nico Donia, they've taken the lead here against Papua New Guinea. For some... That's what you call a pretty pass, a chance here again. Warrison comes in, who's there? No, Papua New Guinea defense quickly recover. Tommy Sammy. The three players around him, Sammy. Uh, well, that's a foul, that's a free kick. Party with Chad Wellapan on his own crew to be part and parcel of everything that's happened this season. Some real hard work gone into bringing you the very best coverage, starting with the OFC Women's Olympic qualifiers in January. That seems like a lot of time ago. That was in January in uh, Samoa. Tommy Semi lines this one up. 
Semi, what can he do? Can he create magic? He goes direct route. Well, he wanted to create magic, but the magic couldn't stick. They still get a second says Cat Boys arriving. Out comes. Dominating the uh, proceedings there, even though they were tested. The Caledonia. Well, now, Ziola over the top into the area where his son comes out. Looking at the options, they put it into the area. Who's there? Well, Ati Kepo is lurking, but not at the right switch. He says, Ziola on to Fedepej. And again, lovely play, these Nicodonians, the three up front. Kachawa. Kachawa. Watch what Friharu was. Manol, Simon. Drops it into the area. Kapu was arriving. Couldn't get it. But Nicaldonia. It's not at the moment happening for Papu New Guinea. Now we come along. Users on FIFA Plus have been phenomenal. And this thanks to your fans as Tommy Sammy creates space for himself. Sammy drives. He knew he had an opening. Couldn't buy him on. Got Tommy Sammy. And a first time shot, he saw the gap. He's looking, there's not much options of red shirts in the middle. He might have to do it alone. Tommy Semi still drive. Keep out still there. Just, just that luck. Not coming. He refused to go in. Look at Tommy Semi. Took on Atale. And he drove his shot through the goalkeeper and just refused to cross the line. Uh, Lafa told me yesterday he wants to change that as. Caledonia almost getting into the 44th we are breaking through this is a chance where his son comes out he is where his son is off his line Nicaldonia with a chance to make it 2-0 they sure do here and lighting up a wet HFC Bank Stadium pitch it is that man Charles got me a fan of pitch we knew what was well a pen Fenepej, Wellapen, into the area, lovely play. Yes, getting it away in time was Shane's lovely play. Touched, and he moved away, Wellapen, just coming in with Spako, so the captain will take it upon himself, drives. Keno gives away possession, Papa Nigini with a chance into the area, well, once again, Left me. Sammy, obviously then arriving. The Papua New Guinea attackers, the defense says, hey, he's got a tally onto his left. He goes for the front, gets a return ball. Chance here. No. Well done by Rex Naime, who's back defending. And so is the veteran top. And they find Fenner Page. Fenner Page against Joe. Daniel Joe, that is still Fenner Page. Faking, moving, tussling. Oh, straight into one. For Tiga. Across the Daddy. Well, he has chance for Fenner Pairs. Lines it up. Still Fenner Pairs. Oh, he was unselfish. That is called teamwork. He could, and this is Tommy Semi. He did really well to move away from Deplong in out. Tommy Semi this time showing what Steeler is in attacker, and then he played it in. Arriving. For his play on. Nothing illegal about it. Papa Nigi with a chance. So Anna there. That is what Tommy Sammy is capable of. He holds one back. Papa Nigi back in the match. That was the one they were complaining about. But Tommy Sammy putting pressure. Well covered by the defense. Physical prowess to his advantage. The captain, the standing captain, Fenner Page. Steal Fenner Page. And then lays it in for, if time permits, win it. But that's in an ideal footballing world in the moment. They need to defend this set piece corner. Everyone says, well, no one had picked Iwan Ine. Told you this man is a goal scoring machine, and he was left all on his own. Papa Nigini into the area, chance here for Papa Nigini. Well, that header 